Here is your first quote. It's clear the country's talking to itself, and it's clear that across the country, people are saying, you know, I think we need Newt Gingrich. <laughs> that was somebody offering a daring bit of political analysis. Who believes that the country really needs Newt Gingrich? I think there's only one person, and that would be Newt Gingrich. It would be! <laughs> I think... I think... I think you're, you, should get, you should get two points, because you're right. There's one person who thinks that, and it is Newt Gingrich. Instead of Mitt Romney, a guy who really, really, really wants to be president, the GOP at last is turning to a guy who thinks he's too good to be president. <laughs> Gingrich once described himself as, quote, an advocate of civilization, definer of civilization, teacher of the rules of civilization, and leader, possibly, of the civilizing forces, unquote. He's not a politician. He's Gandhi with a weight problem. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was about to say, he's done, he, that's Charlton Heston's whole career. Right there, <laughs> running through the movie then. Well, you know what's, what's bad is that now it's down to two people, right? Pretty much. So you have to say Mitt or Newt, because you can't say Newt or Mitt. <laughs> Newt or Mitt. <laughs> That, I would, think, uh, that would be redundant, kid. I, 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 yeah, I think I, it's I, happened already. I was going to say, I think the base has already done that. Yeah. It sounds like a catch span release program. Yeah. Who, Newt, Newt Gingrich has such an incredibly inflated idea of who he is. Who could be his running mate? We're guessing he'll decide the only person who could step into his shoes if he should fail would be himself. He'll be his own vice president. And he will announce that if he were to die in office, he shall rise again after three days. <laughs> Or maybe he will take a rib from his own body and shape a companion for Newt. Someone who will, someone who will always gaze upon him worshipfully, but who will not demand expensive jewelry in return. This time. <laughs> the only flaw in that vice presidential plan, Peter, yeah. is that about five years afterwards, he's going to find a better looking rib on the other side. <laughs> Straight up. Can we spare a moment of pity, though, for poor Mitt Romney? He has been trying for so long, eight years of sucking up to the Republican base now, trying to make himself the perfect candidate, and right before the Iowa caucuses, they all break for Newt Gingrich. Romney must be like, I stayed faithful to my wife for 42 years for this. <laughs> He's like, to hell with it. And he immediately started chugging Jack Daniels and moved his campaign headquarters to a brothel in Tijuana. <laughs> If he did that, he would rock it to, like, number one. Yeah. On he totally would. Yeah. I would yeah. love to see that. I think he has to, like, proposition a woman on the street. And yeah. Get some there, momentum really, back. what's going on? Is the Republican base like, I don't know, Romney, one wife. Has he been tested? 